I'm just careful. I'm just generally stressed about this entire experience. <laughs> Generally, generally very stressed and careful everywhere we're going. <laughs> concerned. I'm concerned. They can both die in the house with Todd. No shit. We killed Todd. Todd's dead as fuck. Obviously. Well, lurkers are killing folks in Hitman? No worries. We've got to finish the barricade. Come on, help me. Hey, help me! Alright. You grab a drink, drink a redo? <laughs> no worries, fatal. You see him again? Really? No shit, Noza. <laughs> hey, Moogs. Um, it's not a spoiler because yeah, we it. haven't seen it yet. I mean, we've already seen it. I know it was not an easy. Yeah, we went the peaceful it. route. Peaceful, peaceful protest. But I'm sure we're doing the right thing. I fucking hope so, man. We've been peaceful so far. Support your people. Check soldier's position. Support your people. Send messages to journalists. Are you alright? They shot into the crowd. Many of us were killed. Yeah, dude. It could have been me. Could have been, but wasn't. I'm scared. I, I don't want to shut down. It's okay to be scared. I'm scared too. But I can't stand by while they kill our people. You understand that, right? Maybe we should have never asked for freedom. Come on now. This would have happened if we'd stayed silent. Magazine. Always good to have a magazine. Go evil and all out. I considered doing an evil playthrough. Brian Deckett's doing what is calling Red Connor playthrough. Which is interesting. Are they getting closer? It won't stop there. What are we gonna do if they attack? Resist. That's the only thing we can do. Do you think Connor has any chance of making it? We can only count on ourselves now. Hopefully Connor makes it. I'm gonna do the best I can. Um, check soldiers positions, support your people. Marcus, we found what you asked for. There's some journalists over there. We have to make sure they know what's going on. We are alive. Oh, north again. This won't hold on for long, but I guess it's better than nothing. Sounds pretty damn good, Fatal. That sounds fucking delicious. They're getting into position. They attacked. 
attack, no one will survive. I hoped they would finally understand. That they would realize how much they're hurting us. Why do they refuse to see what we are? You're the hope of our people. I trust you. We all Oh, trust the snow you. is awesome. The snow adds a nice touch to everything. No matter what happens now, we're making history. Who else? Who else can I talk to? Reminds me of the division? Yeah, city and uh and Stop loving me, North, right? North, I don't care! <laughs> Stop trying to love me! That's a one-way fucking street, North! Marcus! How you doing, Shaz? Marcus, Good to see you. Oh, fuck. Come on. You have my word. I won't try anything. Don't go. It's a trap. They want to get you out in the open. Don't go, Marcus. I'm unarmed, Marcus. I just want to talk. I don't trust him. I need to hear what he has to say. What if they kill you? Attack! And that's a chance I'll have to take. <laughs> no, I'm trusting. I'm trusting. I'm trusting it. I'm also fully expecting to get shot, but, you know. I'm trusting. They've had so many opportunities to shoot him, so... Yeah, exactly, Artemis, yeah. In a few minutes troops will be ordered to charge. None of you will survive. It'll all be over. You can avoid that, Marcus. What do you mean? Surrender. Surrender, and I give you my word, your life will be spared. You'll be detained, but... None of you will be destroyed. Bullshit. What happened to the other androids demonstrating in the camps? Unfortunately... Yeah, there it is. There were no journalists around to help save them. You're it. You're the last remaining deviants. If I accept your offer, how do I know you'll keep your word? You're not in any position to be demanding guarantees, Marcus. All you can do right now is decide whether you want to trust me or not. You asking me to betray my people? I am offering you the chance to save your people. You're not walking out of here, Marcus. The only thing you can save now are the lives of those around you. What do we do? I just, I don't... I'd rather die here. Then betray my people. Fuck you. Well, you just signed your own death warrant. Refuse. Yeah. We haven't come this far and fought this fucking hard to just roll over and die. What happened, Marcus? What did he say? Humans are about to launch an attack. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. 
If we must die today, then we will die free. Oh, fuck. Your crazy life is in your hands. Now it's time to decide what matters most. Him or the revolution? Don't listen to him. Everything this fucker says is a lie. That human means nothing to me. You can kill him if you want, I don't care. I have access to your memory. I know you've developed some kind of attachment to him. Are you really ready to let him die after all you've been through? Are you really going to turn your back on who you've become? I used to be just like you. I thought nothing mattered except the mission. But then one day I understood. Very moving, Connor. But I'm not a deviant. I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task, and that's exactly what I am going to do. Enough talk! It's time to decide who you really are. Are you going to save your partner's life? Or are you going to sacrifice him? <clears throat> all right, all right. You win. Oh, 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 oh. without you oh shit get rid of him we have no time to lose it's me hank i'm the real connor oh shit one of you is my partner the other is a sack of shit question is who's who shit what are you doing hank i'm the real connor give me the gun and i'll Don't take care move. of you move shit why don't you ask us something Something only the real Connor would know. All right. Where did we first meet? Jimmy's bar. I checked four other bars before I found you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was Carlos Ortiz. He uploaded my memory. What's my dog's name? Sumo. Sumo. His name is Sumo. I knew that too. Son, Cole. His name? Cole. Cole. His name was Cole. And he just turned six at the time of the accident. I know Cole. If it wasn't your fault, <sighs> Lieutenant. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Cole needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. So an android had to take care of him. Cole didn't make it. That's why you hate androids. You think one of us is responsible for your son's death. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. He was the one that took my son from me. Him in this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. I knew about your son too. I would have said exactly the same thing. Wow. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who... <laughs> See ya. Yeah, I've learned a lot since I met you, Connor. Hank. Maybe there's something My to boy. W what a fucking turn, though. What a fucking turn. Maybe you'll be the ones to make the world a better place. What a fucking turn. Go ahead and do what you gotta do. That part I did not know. Plot twist is fucking real. Let's do it.
Welcome to the club. Wake up. 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 Okay, that was really stressful. <laughs>